Okay, so you may remember me buying uh, Simpsons Season 9 in my last DVD update. I mentioned I might try and get some more uh, because I'm enjoying that. I finished that season. I was watching it at night. Um, part of my little routine, watching a few Simpsons eps at night. Um, so yeah, um, these were in a Sainsbury's that were not not my local store, quite far out. So, um, But they were £12.50, which is a great price for those cheapest I've seen and then I thought actually eBay have got this free pe free postage and packaging going on have a look on there and I got some more seasons so I got season 8 um, season 7 season 5 season 4 Season 2 and Season 1. So, yeah, the one so Season 1 to 9, but I'm missing 6 and 3. Uh, but I got such a great deal on all of these. The highest I paid for any of them was uh, £10. I think I paid that for Season 8. The rest of them were between £5 and mainly between five and eight pounds with free postage and packaging and they're all really good condition discs are perfect booklets included etc um so i got such a deal and it saved me trekking all the way to that other sainsbury's so that's petrol money and a bunch more money besides so i'm really pleased with that i'm just in a simpsons mood at the moment at night <laughs> weird person that i am so we have season one. I'll just quickly show you the insides. I'm sure you get the gist. So the earlier seasons, that's just the back. The earlier seasons come with a letter from Matt Groening there. Um, three discs for season one and a booklet. Very nice. I'll just leave that open. That's we can speed things up then season two which is four discs this time but back again which is generally the same sort of thing another booklet same sort of thing very nice Oh, it's going to take me ages to fold all those up. Okay, so I didn't get the third season, but I got the fourth season. Same sort of thing again. I've got back again. And, of course, they were digipacks at this point, which are lovely. They're now digi stacks. Um, and I think season 11 is that slim line. I know season 11 is a lot thinner. And everyone's annoyed about it. So that's season four. Got enough Simpsons here to last a lifetime. Uh, season five. Still the same. You get the idea. And then we go on to sort of the new the new style. So we have season seven here. They've all got like these little cutouts. And then you've got Marge. And then this is where they do the start doing the digi stacks, but they still still a nice design and then they've got in this one you get a Smithers top trumps card. <laughs> and you get the um paper style thing which is really cool like the season 9 is the Rolling Stone magazine it's such a cool book I love it ok and then the last one is season 8 which is Maggie and I know you can get the limited edition head some of you might think that I would like to collect those but I actually really don't like the limited edition heads I don't like the plastic packaging 
and the way it sort of sticks out I like these because they look all nice next to each other so you've got Maggie's tooth there and again this is the same this time it's like a photo album um, thing and I love the disc art on all of these they're all sort of themed so you've got like Maggie one two three four and the back how cool is this I love it and then you have photo album style book very cool and look at the state of this now I've got to put all that back but yep that's the Simpsons various seasons very cool nowhere to put them whatsoever but I'm in, looking forward to watching them so that is all bye okay so I thought I'd tag this on the end because I've just come back from Sainsbury's and I bought Animal starring this guy and I recognise him from lots of films Terence Howard yeah the only reason I bought it I love Terence Howard and also one pound absolute bargain um, and here's the sticker that I was telling people on Twitter, Twitter about. It says, please remove prior to putting in the microwave. E what? Yeah. I love it. Um, and it's still sealed, so it's open. Basic disc. Could you get more basic than that? I mean, at least with the Paramount discs, they're silver. This is white. But it is quite cool. It's widescreen, of course, and it's... um. It's got cast interviews, so it's um, pretty good for one pound. And um, back by popular demand, there's Oz looking at me disapprovingly. Now he's crying. He absolutely hates the camera, and also he can't get downstairs on his own, so he probably wants me to take him. So say bye, Oz. Nope.